Hello everyone, Eat Sleep from the Techies here, bringing you another Paint.net tutorial. In today's tutorial, we're going to cover on how to create fiery text. Yeah. So for this tutorial, you're going to need two plugins. You're going to need the plugin uh, Fire and Flames. They might be in the description. They might not be. You know. But so what we're going to do is we're going to create our text. It's going to say Eat Sleep with our font, nice big font there. Uh, next we're going to grab our magic wand tool and shift and click on th the name and everything selects. Next we're going to go to effects, <clears throat> excuse me, render clouds and for the clouds you want to have a black to sort of a grayish color looks the best to me and uh, you can mess with this how you want it's not really gonna make a difference but yeah that next I'm gonna hit escape to deselect the text um, next uh, what we need to do is we need to add a little blur so it kind of looks like real fire because if we just add a fire to this it looks pretty bad so then next we'll just do uh, effects blurs Gaussian blur and uh, I think five should be pretty good. Five, yeah, we can um, repeat this Gaussian blur a few times. Let's do three. Three, three's good. Good stuff. Um, now we can add the fire. We can go to effects, render, fire. And that's what it looks like if you use fire. And it, the more blur you do, it looks different and unique. You can experiment with that and you can play with the roughness and actually that doesn't change anything does it so anyways that's just fire and if you want to use flames you can use flames too that also looks pretty cool just depends what effect you're going for and this one you can mess around with the uh, roughness and scale and stuff so so that's pretty cool so yeah um, I hope this was uh, helpful Thank you for watching. This has been Eat Sleep from the Techies. Be sure to check out the Techies website for great game and software reviews, as well as a database of all Techies videos. Also, please sign up to our forum where you can request a tutorial or just talk about something that interests you.